Should I be like, hello, everybody, welcome to another exciting episode of the Pokemon Sword and Shield episode. If you guys have not checked out the last episode, definitely go ahead and check it out. There should be a title card right over here, and you guys can go ahead and click that title card and go to the previous episode, because last episode was full of subsequent shenanigans. Actually, not really, because I cut most of it out. But anyways, let's get on with the gameplay, guys, because I am so excited with the DLC and everything that's about to happen, like with all the story modes that we've gone through. I feel like I think this might be the finale. Like, this might be the last episode of, like, actual content. So let's see what's up. All right. Mustard. Welcome back by Wandering Wulu. Oh, what? Oh, and what is that sweet scent I detect wafting through the air around you? Hmph. <laughs> That'd be like the max honey that Urushifu loves to the max. We got our hands on a nice haul of it. Did you now already? Hmm. You put me an awesome Ju 18 on, eh, old man. There's nothing the two of us can do together. <laughs> you really did a bang up job finding the max honey with hardly a hint from me. Huh. Very nicely done, awesome Ju 18, and our little hop too. You didn't forget for a second what that certain something was, did you? <laughs> oh my god, Mr. Mustard, let's something else. If we had Max Honey to our Max Soup, even Ushupa would be sure to want to take a sip. Ooh. Well, it's been a real awesome, Joey Team, but I think you'll learn just about everything the Master Dojo has to teach you. Which means that you and I can finally have a proper battle with absolutely no holding back. I could use a bit of training if I were to be ready for what's to come, after all. What do you mean? I won't be pulling any punches this time, kiddo. If you think you're really ready for me when I'm serious, then come to the battle court out back. All right, man. Oh, okay. All right. I, I see you. Is that our final phase for this DLC? Is there anything more? Are we supposed to be expecting some crazy plot twist and then a legendary comes out or something? I don't know, guys. If you guys do know, let me know in the comment section below. Because I think by the time that goes out, I already know what's up. So anyways. Battling the master when he's serious. There's something terrifying. He's the one who taught Lee all he knows, so Mustard's got to be one wicked strong trainer. Of course he has. Steal your spirit for serious battle, awesome Jewy teen. Huh. I guess I better start getting serious about the research I came here to do too. Good luck with your things, awesome Jewy teen. I'm sure you'll manage like you always do. I'll come dashing right back to catch that battle though if you do try taking on Master Mustard. My boy, what if you're on the other side of this DLC area? I forgot what, what area. I, I guess the Isle of Armor. What if you're on the other side, like in the Lagoon? Uh, I think it's the Lagoon of Dragon or something. I already forgot. I mean, even though I edited the episodes like literally last night. Uh, today is Monday. <laughs> I, I hope that whatever comes our way past that door is nothing too difficult, which I doubt it is. I mean, Leon was, even though I lost a spoiler alert, Shady Lock, I don't think it's that bad. But without further ado, I'm gonna go and equip up, cook up some teams and do some other stuff, side stories, or I mean, not do side stories, I'm gonna do some side deans and then I'll blop to once we get out of there. All right, guys, so we are finally back and let me tell you real quick what I did off screen and that was basically create my team to prep for this guy over here that you see before your screen and the second thing that I was doing off screen was trying to get some max suit but I found out it took a little bit of grinding I'm not too familiar on the process all I know is I had to do dynamax battles and grow it out that way or something like that and I thought to myself I don't have that time so you know what I might as well show one specific G max form in this battle so without further ado let's get on with the little story tackling battling guy well, I, I know. I don't even know what I just said. But anyways, Mustard. Woohoo! Are you ready for another battle with little old me? Of course, my man. Heh heh heh. That's what I want to hear. Then let's mosey on over to the battleground. My, my man. I'm sorry, Mustard, but I'm going to make you into some ketchup, bro. I'm going to throw hands with my Bulbasaur. <clears throat> Mustard. <clears throat> I mean, you know, I've been thinking more and more these days, you know, about how fortunate we had you to Wait, what? About how fortunate we were to have you join the dojo. Even if it was by mistake at first. I can't thank you enough, awesome Jewy team. It's been a while since I've been so excited. I can feel my blood burning and my heart just dancing with anticipation. I just can't resist a battle against a worthy opponent no matter how old I get. <laughs> now then. Let's get things going. This is the most fun time in the world. Yo. 
Yo, all right, round two with uh, actual serious team. I, uh, I don't know what Master Dojo got up on his and sleeve. Yeah, six Pokemon. I, I, I thought so. He'd have six Pokemon, guys. So I kind of prepped for this. I led off with my main lead because I want to kind of like make him think that I'm a fool and all that, you know. I want him to think that I have no idea of Pokemon battling. So, oh my god. <laughs> okay, Mian Shao is a little bit different than I thought. You know what? I'm gonna go and hit up that Endeavor and hopefully it doesn't kill me. Please don't kill. No! Oh my god! <laughs> let that be a reminder. A single slip could cost you everything. Let that be a reminder. Do not let my looks be deceiving, Mr. Mustard. I let that on, you know, for a very specific reason. Because I'm gonna unload the dog poop. I know, I was, I'm not trying to curse. I have a tendency to curse that a lot. But anyways, we are here finding out that we are a bit underleveled. And honestly, I'm gonna send out my second fake Pokemon just so he thinks that he's got the upper edge, honestly. Yeah, as you guys already see my team, I'm just joking around here, trying to play it off. You, you, you see me and shoot, you see me, me and shout. <laughs> and I'm about to psych him up. Suck him up. Oh, you churn. Oh, with them strats, my boy. Okay, but my dude is playing no type of games. So, what is he gonna replace mustard with? I mean, me and shout with Luxray. All right. I see you. I see you, my boy. I'm gonna go ahead and counteract that with Lala. Hopefully, you have a physical type move because if you don't, then holy crap, Lala will be proven useless in this battle. So, let's go and counteract your Yuchon with my counter. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. Ooh, I barely even survived that counter, counter, boy. Counter, counter, counter. Get that thing out of my screen. Come on, Lala. Oh my god, Lala picked up the first kill that is what's up all right so la moan says level 62 my baby girl man shout oh man lala honestly you proving your worth and it's time for you to take a step back you know i'm not gonna let you faint like the rest of my other two pokemon i'm gonna go ahead and throw up my boy charlie you know, I, I believe Charlie has that potential to show off to all these Pokemon, all his Pokemon, that they're all trash. So let's go, Charlie. Let's go. Let's go. Boom. Boom. Shaka laka laka. Boom. Boom. Shaka laka. Boom. We're going to go and use acrobatics, my boy. Go do it. Do it. Do it. Oh. All right. Fake out. I see you. I see you, man. I see you. All right. Hopefully, Charlie is faster than me and Shell. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. All right, we're in a bit of trouble here with the me and Shell. Honestly, I didn't think it would be that scary. Well, at least now it's going to be O-Code. Hopefully. All right, it got one shot. so... Hmm, I see you put your fundamentals down bad, but that alone won't cut it. I know, man. I know that won't cut it. I only took down two Pokemon. You took two of mine, so we're for two for two. So let's see what we can do with the last remaining Pokemon. But honestly, I think I got you down in the bag. Unless you have like a level 1000 Pokemon, then we talking. We talking. All right. Ugh. So Urishifu, I, I really don't want you to die, my friend. I sincerely do not want you to die right now but unfortunately i might have to let you take the bucket right here unless he's faster no you're not all right charlie all right oh that thunder punch ain't gonna do crap well 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 all right oh my god charlie yo charlie yo charlie all right okay all right we're gonna go and Hit it up with that surging strikes and hopefully you could deal like some amazing crits here. Go, my boy. Go, 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 go. One. Come on. Oh my god, bro. Look over to you. I have you. That makes you all the more enticing an opponent. I know, man. Alright. Two crits. Come on. Three crits. Oh, that's not enough, man. That's not enough. Okay. Come on. I, 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 I gotta find a way. Come on. Oh, Charlie, my boy. I, I'm so sorry, Charlie, but I gotta make this an enticing battle. We're gonna go and shoot off my second to last Mon. 
because honestly, let's be honest, Lala is pretty, pretty much dead. So we're gonna be in Lil Ted G, my boy over here. We're gonna basically snipe shot everybody here. But we're not gonna clean up shot with my boy Lil Ted G, because that's a little bit of overkill, honestly. So we're gonna go and blop. Alright, Corey Knight. Bye bye, my boy. Bye bye. See you later. See you later. Bye bye. Let go. Alright. So he's about to send Komomo. I see you. I see you a fighting and dragon type. Nice, nice, nice. All right, for a, a master dojo man trainer, like, I see you. All right, Komomo is a Pokemon you do not want to mess with. He has bulky defense, and honestly, I don't even think my ace or the Pokemon I want to show off has the power to just take this on on its own. So we're going to go ahead and throw out that Stone Edge, and hopefully that's more than enough. Oh my god. Yikes. Yikes. Yikes, Lala. Oh my god, Lala. Why? Why? Why, la la la, mamma mia, mamma mia, why, why? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and set on Lotaji because I know Monte cannot deal with this situation alone. So we're gonna go ahead and let someone take care of it for her. So let's go, snipe shot my boy, real quick. Take it down, take out the Kamomo. Oh, actually, I don't even think he could take care of it. All right, um. Guys, okay, I, I'm, uh, uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm a little bit afraid here, guys. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm a little bit afraid here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. Okay, Kamomo. I am. I know it's potential. That's why, because I've owned a Kamomo, and honestly, this is something you do not want to play around with. Oh no. All right. All right. Come on. Oh no. Oh, another one? Okay. Oh my god. He could have le legitimately sweep right there, guys. He could have legitimately sweeped me right there, guys. You guys don't even know the situation. <laughs> if I had been like level 75 on par, that would have been like GG, guys. Honestly. No jokes. So he's about to send out Lincoln Rock, and I think this is a good enough opponent to show off the star of this battle because I'm about to show off the G Max form of my baby girl Monse. So let's go and do it. Leak and Rock, let's go. Is it a dust form? No, it's the day the day form. Alright, alright, I see you. So we're gonna go ahead and G Max and G Max Vine Lash. Let's see what what's he got in store. Alright, so this is a grass type move with a base 120 power. Uh, that Gigantamax the Unicer uses. This move continues to deal damage to opponents for four turns. Oh, okay. I see you. All right, let's see this. Let's see this. First appearance, first appearance. Thumbnail moment over here. Thumbnail moment. Let's go. All right. So the V. I was about to say Mega Venusaur, but it's Gigantamax Venusaur. Yo, that that looks freaking lit. Not gonna lie, that looks freaking lit. Freaking. Lit my boy, my boys. I mean, <clears throat> so Stealth Rock, poor choice. We're gonna about to see this animation real quick. Let's see what's up. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Vine Lash, bro. Ooh, all right, we get to see what that four turns effect happens. Ooh, all right, that is actually kind of. Kind of hot, so we're gonna go ahead and hit up that max guard real quick because you won't be able to hit me. Stone Edge, no worries, it won't hit me. Max guard and let the ferocious. I see you guys, look at that. And if they actually, I could see that being used in actual like Wi Fi battles, like that strat. So I go into level 63, that's kind of hot. So the second one is Urishifu, but the other form isn't it. My skills are only getting sharper. Try to get, not to get captivated by my might. Yo, monster, you, you try not to be captivated, and this is the dark form, isn't it? Yeah, it's the dark form. Hmm. All right, we're gonna go ahead and use G Max. Now become the gigantic fist that breaks your opponent as one was smashed through a board. Oh, G Max. G Max versus G Max. Oh God. Oh no. Oh no. Oh um, no! Oh God! Oh God! I might not even be able to take a hit from this guy. 
Oh gosh, please not max airstream or something like that. If it's max airstream. Okay, I could take that. Okay, I could take that. I could take that, definitely. What, what does that do? Boost up your defense? G Max Vine Slash. Let's go! And that did absolutely crap. Oh, that's kind of gonna be biting me in the butt now. Ah, uh, Monse, I don't want to see you go down like this, girl. But you're gonna take one for the team and you're gonna go ahead and do that. Ooh. Let's see if you can withstand this move. Show me what you're made of. Oh, my girl. My girl's gonna get beaten down. Oh my god, one blow? What? Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, it's like Exodia. Obliterate. It's, it's kind of like that. Now I'm down to one final Pokemon. Honestly, I'm a, I'm a little bit afraid. I don't even know if we could defeat this battle. It'd be kind of embarrassing if I was talking crap all this time and I don't and I'm not be and I'm not able to defeat it. Defeat him. So hopefully this knife shot has what it takes. Oh okay. Oh Max Knuckle. Oh ooh, 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 ooh. my god. That it really, 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 really <laughs> Do not boost your speed. Do not boost your speed. I was about to say if that boosts up your speed, I'd be like crying right now. I'd be crying. All right. Do oh, it's gonna have surging strikes, isn't it, or something like priority? Don't have priority, my boy. All right, cool. All right. We finally made all that battle alive. I was a little bit afraid. I was cocky. I was cocky. I was cocky. But we did it, guys. We did it. We bought. We won. Let me find out he has a six month. And I beat it, the defeated Master Dojo. All right, I defeated you, boy. I defeated you. Huh? Strength ebbs. Huh? And next, it slips from your man. I don't even know what I was saying right there. Jeez! If you guys have not checked out the last episode, y you see some weird gibberish coming out of my mouth. But anyways, let's get back onto the screen. But the strength you now have, the strength that lets you defeat me, is unwavering. Congratulations from the bottom of my heart. All right. I got 30k, thank you very much. That should pay off my housing bills, uh, a couple of bills for the next couple of months, you know. All right. <laughs> I held absolutely nothing back and yet you still defeated me. Hmm. The apprentice sure passes his master, a true moment of pride for the master. Hmm. You deserve a very special league card from me. What type of league come up, boy? Like, you doing some cool moves? Or what? What, what, what? All right, I wanna see this. It seems I will have to redo my own training from scratch. Oh, darling, did I hear right? You actually lost? Ah, uh, so you all came. <laughs> you know, I can't resist seeing you get all serious about battle, you cheeky fiend. You look utterly dashing, darling. Oh, oh, but like me getting all distracted, you were amazing, awesome, Jewy teen. Looks like we'll need to have some Max Soup tonight to celebrate. I know you weren't just a new student. I think I'll call you Master Newbie from now on. <laughs> Well, I'm not surprised one bit, Austin Joey Team. I knew you win. And you were fabulous too, Rishifu. I see you. Uh, awesome Joey Team. What's up? What's up, Clara? I I just well, I guess I should congratulate you, you know, but I won't. Why should I celebrate anything to do, huh? Wait, what? <laughs> I think I read that wrong. My bad guys. Uh still, that cleared up a lot. You're strong enough to be the master going all out. I never stood a chance. <laughs> but the next time I face you, I'll take you on fair and square and I won't lose. You'll see. Hmm. Are you sure, girl? Are you sure? Ah, you're downright infrutuating. You know that? Almost as bad as I am. Well, at least she's aware of her own flaws, you know? Phew. Well, that wraps up the last of the training here at the Master Dojo. Oh, back to normal, huh, master? Awesome, Joey Teen. I hope you'll come by and have more battles with me from time to time. It'll make us both stronger, you know? Just just so when we're ready when the time comes. What do you mean? Uh, oh, don't worry. You'll find out what I'm talking about eventually. Anyway, let's all head back. Shall we like one big happy family? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I, I, I seen so much anime would be like, yeah! Yeah! So let's see what this guy is talking about. Like potential legendary from like the trailers and all that. Is that what I'm hoping? Or is this is actually the end? Guys, this is actually the end? This is the end of the DLC? You're kidding. Wow, so there wasn't really much to this DLC then. Hmm. So that was the end. Wow. 
So is there really anything else to do at the Master Dojo? Let's see. I can't believe you beat the Master, even when he was serious. Awesome, Joey Team. You might be able to tackle this mo dojo's most grueling type of training ever, restricted sparring. If you have the courage to try it, let me know. Uh, tell me how it works. Actually, I'm curious to know. So, Restricted Sparring is a training course that restricts the type of Pokemon you can use. Select the type first and then battle using up to three Pokemon of that type. No duplicate Pokemon or items are allowed. If you can win five times in a row, you'll complete the turn. However, if you lose even once, the sparring will end there. You can restore your Pokemon between battles, but only twice in total, so use the opportunities very wisely. That's all. Do you want to try Restricted Sparring? No thanks. So, by the looks of it, you're gonna, for this type of training, you want to use Pokemon that basically could heal on their own. Maybe some leftovers with recover strats or something like that. Maybe some paint split strategies right there, um, by the looks of it. But other than that, I don't know what else is left to do here at the Isle of Armor. Uh, I thought there was going to be a legendary Pokemon. Maybe it was just all an exaggeration for my part. But honestly, I'm going to go back inside and go ahead and talk to Hop. And let's see what other type of things that we could do in this episode. Maybe, maybe that's it. Alright, let's see. Oh, you know what? I ran into that one gym leader at the station when I came here to the Isle of Army. Remember that one? I guess all sorts of folks are starting to come here to the island to train a bit. I see, I see. Is there anything else I can do? So I'm going to go ahead and talk to Honey real quick. Let's see what's up. Oh, awesome, Joey Team. Just the person I wanted to see. Uh, do you collect Watts? Sure I do. Of course you do. You're such a pro at all this, awesome, Joey Team. I'll have you know that the Watt business is positively booming right now and around here. They say that those who hold the most Watts hold the key to success. I've actually been trying to gather up Watts to spruce up the dojo a bit, get some more gear, but both my darling hubby and my son are more the indoor types, you know? And it's pretty hard for me to collect that many Watts all on my own. If you ever happen to have some Watts to spare, awesome joy, I'd be glad to take them. Oh, but I wouldn't ask you to give them to me and not get anything in return. So this is, would be a business charge to action, of course. I'll reward you for your generosity. Whenever you have some extra Watts, simply come and talk to me. All right, let's see. Um, sure. All right. Let's see. I'll give you five, one thousand. Let's see. What does that do? All right. So if you could spare another, let, then let's see. I could hire a special for the dojo so you could change your hair whenever you like. Oh, love, love. I see you. I see you. What? What else? All right. Let me get. Let me like. Yeah. Let's go. You've given us 6,000 so far. So with over 5,000 wallets, I can afford to have a hairstylist come over here at the dojo too. Of course, I, I do need a haircut, you know? Get the sides a little bit trimmed, a little bit on the sides, you know? All right, thank you, honey. All right, yeah, yeah, all right. Ooh, they're sending someone right over. Ooh. Hello, dojo. It's lovely to meet y'all. I'm your new hairstylist, but I can bear all the secret arts of hairstyling to y'all. So when you like to have something done, please call me on in this room here. No cameras allowed. And no speaking of what you see inside this room. Huh. Now that's a real pro. True masters are always speaking about their crap. <laughs> but now we can look our best. Even out here in the wilds. I see. I see. What else? Let's see. Let's see what's up. Let's see what else. Let's see what else. I I'm about to part another 5,000 and see what happens. Alright. Let's see. You're giving us 11,000. Now we gather over 10,000. I can order a Rotomini terminal for the dojo? The hell is a Rotomini dojo? Uh, hello? Is, is is this the Pokemon Center? This is Honey from the Master Dojo. I'd like to buy one of your Rotami terminals for some what? But what do you say? Um, hmm, yeah, that's right, you know? Mm -hmm. Yo, this is some real business transactions. Ooh, I see you. We were able to make a deal and I got to the center over here right over at once. Hmm, though, it doesn't quite seem right. There's something written on the screen here. Now, let's see. Thank you for your purchase. To get your new road telling you up and running, you must first install our proprietary software. In order to order your copy today, contact our sales department at what? They're simply trying to gauge us more for months of all that greedy, conniving, conniving business practices. I am awfully sorry about this, awesome joy team, but it looks like we're going to need a bit of your help to get our road telling up and running. I see you. You want him, man? She, it, it sounds like right now she's kind of a little. I'm not gonna try to put the the term gold digger, but she's trying to use me, you know. So let's hear. Have ten thousand watts. Let's see what. Let's see what's up with her update. So you have twenty one thousand. Let's see. Ooh, hoo, hoo. all right, all right. Am I just spending money like an idiot? Maybe I am. <laughs> Hello, this is the Pokemon Center, honey from the Monster Dojo. Yes, again, fancy that. 
We already wrote Tommy from you a little while ago back. Yeah, yes, yes, it does look lovely, but we rather prefer it to actually work too, you know? Hmm. Can you send one right over? Now that's the king girl. Let's fire it up. Please to greet you. Bzzz. Honey. Rel Tammy at your service. Bzzz. Hmm. And I'm delighted to hear it. I'm sure it'll be, sure be worth every last what you've cost us. In fact, we'll make sure of it. Our Rel Tommy is up and running thanks to your wild awesome joke team. So be sure to use it plenty. Alright, what happens if I just put a thousand? I'm just gonna put a thousand. Oh my god. Just five thousand is the max? Alright, hmm, <clears throat> oh, I'll put in a vending machine where you can buy really cheap drinks wherever you like. Wow, so basically we are using Watts to basically kind of in a way to, it's like kind of like a Clash of Clans scene, like level up the dojo, add some cool features and all, and all sorts of things on this dojo. So that's pretty interesting, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'm... So before I continue on and do some other stuff, or if there's any other stuff, I'm gonna go talk to Master Dojo, see if there's anything else we can do. I know it's at the end, but let's see if there's something else. Hello, awesome Jersey. Care to have a battle with little old me? No. All right. So I think there is. That's all there really is here. So unfortunately, that's that. That kind of sucks. All right, awesome Jersey. Okay. Um. This is the guy that I was trying to talk to, but I need to get more max mushrooms, and to do that, I apparently had to go do some Dynamax battles. I think I mentioned that early in the episode, so... Alright, guys. So, from the last segment that I recorded, this episode was like 30 minutes apart, and honestly, I was trying to see what other things we could do in the Isle of Armor DLC, and the only thing that popped to my mind was this Tower of Darkness. So, unfortunately, I cannot do this because I did the water challenge for whatever it was called. I think it's... Let's see. It was... Um... What was it called? Jesus. The Tower of Water. So, unfortunately, because I did the Tower of Waters, I can't do the Tower of Darkness. Which kind of sucks, but oh well. What am I going to do? But anyways, uh, in terms of the future for this series, since um, this is pretty much all I can do to the DLC for this DLC until the next one comes out being the Tundra, Crown Tundra or something like that. So whenever that one comes out, I'll be doing content on that one as well. But in terms of future videos for the Isle of Armor, I'll practically uh, complete the Pokedex. That's one video. And the second potential video that I have in mind is basically doing the Diglett Challenge of collecting all 150. And that's pretty much it that comes to mind in... If anything comes my way throughout that whole entire two episode like creation, something else I want to create for this series, I'll let you guys know and on Twitter. So definitely go ahead and check it out on Twitter. I mean, follow me on Twitter, which all my social media is down in the description below. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. A small short series it was like five episodes long. So comment down below what was your favorite part throughout this whole entire series. Or I don't know, comment something random. Maybe what's your favorite type of fish is it salmon is it red fish orange fish something random like that i don't know but with that being said this has been your weird old friend geo aka giovanni huerta oh my god that's such a weird intro but anyways i'll see you in the next video whether it be completing the pokedex or doing the diglett challenge peace